Fire investigators working to figure out what caused a house to explode in Huntington. One man was taken to the hospital. We've been following this story since early this morning. It happened in the 900 block of Leopold Street just after 6 o'clock. News Channel 15's Angelica Robinson talked with neighbors, and she joins us now with what she found out. Well, many of them woke up to a loud noise in what felt like a small earthquake. Several hours later, fire crews were still on scene investigating, and neighbors still shaken up by the whole ordeal. Out of nowhere, it was huge. The fire was huge. Kendra Fisher snapped this picture of the fire when she says the flames were at their peak. But before she realized the fire, she was getting her daughter ready for school this morning. I had heard the big boom and then an orange flash off like in the corner of my eye. And at first I thought she had fallen off the bed. She was okay, but Fisher realized her neighbor was not. She ran outside, another woman already on the phone with 911. Several others trying to help a man stuck inside this home on the 900 block of Leopold Street. He told him he needed to get out of there, that the house was on fire, and he said that he couldn't, he was stuck. And he goes, well, are you on the first or second floor? And I didn't hear a response after that, but I heard loud banging like they were trying to get inside and get to him. Emergency crews responded within minutes, and that man was taken to the hospital. It's unclear to us and neighbors who that man is or how badly he was hurt. Anthony Trainer lives just a couple of houses down. Every now and then you see the see the owner and then a couple other guys that helped him work. But other than that, seriously, I didn't know anybody lived there. Within about 10 minutes, the fire was under control. Both Trainer and Fisher say it could have been much worse, but still, they're rattled by all of the commotion. It's a little concerning, especially since I have a newborn baby. Just moved back here like a week ago to the side of town, so it's pretty nuts that that had happened, like, so close. The Huntington Fire Chief says it does not appear to be suspicious, and there is a possibility it could have been a gas leak. In studio, Angelica Robinson, News Channel 15.